ready. Welcome to Summoner's Rift. Baseball? I don't know. I think it's like all sports. Like I grew up playing baseball, and I don't know. It's just part of my life, kind of. I don't watch it anymore, though. I'll ahead. I used to a lot, but. Thirty seconds until minions spawn. I think it's part of like my ADD, like the ADD culture kind of where I just can't watch anything for more than like five seconds without getting bored. Baseball is really slow and like unless you really like care about what like like I, the thing is I used to care about the players. Part of the part of the thing that ruined baseball for me is the fact that um, players kept changing teams. I used to like when I like I knew everybody on the team. I'm not sure if it was always like that where like people stayed on a team for like a year and then they switched teams, but I used to watch the Mariners. I used to live in Seattle. I watched the Mariners when uh A Rod and uh Randy Johnson and That flash. Wait, we have Shaco. What the fuck? Oh, I think the game before the other team had Shaco. Yeah, the Mariners just be OP. That's part of the reason why I liked it, but. You'll come again. I think he actually might come again. <laughs> I don't know why he wouldn't. Thank. I think you'll come again. Let me get some Dorans up in this bitch. Cause I want, I, what I want right now is I want a lot of health. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna go with, like pretty AP-ish, but... I feel like Vi is gonna try to... Okay, GG. I feel like Vi is gonna try to uh, gave me a lot, so I just want a lot of health. I'm not gonna go like 80 though. Especially when I have like 500, like there's no better buy, I don't think. Honestly, dude, earlier, like having the Vi waste her time like that, it's almost worth me blowing my flash. If I don't die, like if I die again, or if I die now, like it wouldn't have been worth it. But if I don't die, like blowing my flash like that is not that bad. Especially when Vi can't really gank me. Like if I have a ward, Vi... I don't know how she's gonna gank me. They pull some epic, like, some epic brush. Canyon or something. I could have actually got, like, a no mantle on that buy, but. Honestly, all I wanna do is shove this guy up the tower all game, so. 
Full extra auto attack damage doesn't hurt. I just gotta not make this obvious. Perfect timing. I'm gonna go Abyssal. Abyssal is a good all in item. I still wanna die this guy, I just wanna be able to shove him up. Top lane is like it's really sketch dude. I don't I don't feel comfortable going like full AP in top lane because me having resistances it makes it so Vi's not gonna wanna gate me. If you go too squishy though, like you're just gonna get camped all day. You're gonna have a bad time. Sorry bro, I gotta buy. Good luck, rest in pieces. Oh my god. They're beasts. Rumble's gonna be there too. I'm gonna go another D-Blade. Oh. Too manly. Don't give him double buff. No. Oh, damn. Double off rumble is like pretty well though. Can't really do anything with it. Good job, sir.
complete. What did I buy that though? Oh, I was coming. Oh, it shake is good, dude. Oh my god, she goes good, dude. That's smart. Um. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna go Abyssal and then Sword Boost and then like Zonians or something, I think. Zonians actually good for fighting Rumble, it's just that. It's good for fighting the Vi too, but it's just good to have MR too. You should have pauses there. Oh, beast. This guy's a beast, dude. GG. I get my uh, haunting guys right now. Which I wasn't even like planning on getting, but I had the perfect amount for it. Actually, I could have almost bought a large rod. Oh! 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 Gungam style. Yeah, but I thought I was going middle, dude. 
I'll never build full AP champ on. I, I honestly don't even build full AP champ, but. Top, you need the extra health from Durant's IMO. You don't, like, you don't need it, but I just like it. I just love Durant's. I have a special relationship with Durant's. You know what I don't get is why AD carries don't build like tanky a little bit. Like Ninja Tabi. I would think that Ninja Tabi would be a great AD, AD carry item. Like if okay, here's the thing. If if you have two AD carries fighting each other, right? One has Ninja Tabi, one has Zerkers. The Ninja Tabi AD carry is always gonna win. Unless it's like a stupid champion like Vayne. I'm just saying like standard AD carries though. Oh god, rumble there. Careful. I'm gonna start building towards the Zonias now. I'm not even gonna sword boots. Let's just make it so I don't die ever. Which is good. AD carries don't fight each other that often. That's not true. You can afford, like. If you pressure bottom, if you pressure, if you like keep pushing bottom. And then you have top lane splitting top, and then you have mid lane pushing mid. Like they have to go back to lanes. So if you have like an, like that's why I always, th I always think like, if I had an AD carry, they got Ninja Tabi, and like built like kind of tanky. And then a mid that built like, pretty tanky kind of, but like, was able to 1v1 their mid, and then I'm able to 1v1 their top, like we'll win. Because, essentially what happens is like, you have people that build like certain ways to, to rush into a team fight. But like, if you're really strong in lane, like you don't have, you, you can just keep splitting and like, they have to go back to lanes. Or they're just gonna lose out on XP. Like say they send three top or whatever, then you have bottom just pushing. Bottom's gonna get turret. Like they can only do that once or twice, and they're gonna you're gonna get turrets. And if your top lane's good, they won't even die, so. I don't know, I'm just kinda rambling at this point, but. I like items like Abyssal, like, yeah, it's not great for mushroom damage, but, like, if, if the fight comes to a melee, which it inevitably does, and they dive, then, uh, Abyssal's gonna be super useful. Like, if I'm gonna fight Lissandra, she's gonna be on my ass, she's gonna be in there. <laughs> 